Good morning from the City Farm Homestead Free Plant and Garden Stand. I wanted to share with you this harvest. I'm about ready to make a brunch for my family. And everything that you see here was either gifted to me or somebody dropped at the stand. The only thing not on this list that I'm cooking with that I didn't grow are the potatoes and the garlic. I didn't have that much success this year with garlic, but everything else is just freshly cut. The other thing I forgot to add is there's some beets that are going to seed. I did pull those up. I'll probably just stick those on the side. But anyway, also you gotta check out this cute little cup I found this morning at my stand. I love it. It is super cute. Thank you whoever dropped that off. I used it to pick the goji berries. Look at that color, they match. So I'm keeping that cute little cup. There's that mountain basil and check out these Itolia onions. Those onions grow really well. They're very mild, easy to grow. I have a few in shade, some in full sun. But those little bulbs, you just cut the green off and use that. You can also use the, the red part, which I'm gonna today, the red purple part, but I'm gonna save a few to replant. I don't even dry them out. I just clean them off and stick them back in the ground and they come back. The onion harvest here too is eh, not too good this year, but they'll work. And then those, the society garlic right there, those chives, the reason it's called society garlic is because the high class society people didn't want to have bad breath so they liked using that for garnish or flavor but it didn't give the strong garlic breath anyway I hope you get out to a stand and start growing some of the stuff that's donated or if you have something to donate that would be great too because Everybody gets to have free stuff, and if it doesn't make it, it doesn't get so upsetting when it doesn't make it. But I also wanted to share with you, look at those little pretty white flowers on that thyme. I'm going to take the leaves off and leave those little seeds to finish flowering and package those up. I'll also try to root it and get some cuttings going. But get out to those garden stands in your neighborhood and support them. That way we can bring back gardening culture together.